October for Breast Cancer Awareness Month, at least two national landmarks are lighting up the night pink. As you can see here, the Empire State Building and the White House both acknowledging Breast Cancer Awareness Month. Well, here at CBS 42, as we fight the local war on breast cancer, we're lighting up our studio pink as well, as you can see below us there. All this month, we are committed to covering the local war on breast cancer. CBS 42 News reporter Hillary Simon joins us now with what she's been doing yeah, today. Yeah, Hillary, one local fire department taking a unique approach to raise awareness about that disease. Jack, that's right. Center Point firefighters are driving a pink truck around town. It's turning heads and awareness about breast cancer. Now, the Center Point Fire District has had this truck for five years. It's covered with signatures of survivors and those who signed in memory of someone who lost their battle with cancer. Now, the department started getting involved with breast cancer awareness after one of their own who was involved in breast cancer awareness died in the line of duty. And their chief, who is now cancer free, credits his survival with a doctor who was part of the Breast Cancer Awareness Foundation of Alabama. So a lot of history there. It's not just in October. We see it every day. Um, and we just felt like when we can, every now and then we'll put this truck in service and let and, uh, and some of their territory, let them respond to these calls. We've had people come out and that's made their day. That makes them feel better. They come out and they sign the truck in their memory or in memory of someone else that's had breast cancer. Now, the pink truck isn't the only thing they do. They also are part of the Pink Ribbon Project with many other fire departments, including Hoover. Several fire departments are selling T-shirts that go right back to the Breast Cancer Research Foundation of Alabama. And these are the T-shirts that the fire districts are handing out. Coming up six, hear exactly where the money is going from these sales. In the studio, Hillary Simon, CBS 42 News, local coverage you can count on. All right, Hillary, thanks. You can also find the Pink Ribbon Project T-shirts for sale down at UAB.